Yo, we are back here at my old childhood bedroom because I'm back home. Let me give you guys a little rundown of what happened to get here right now. For the past three years, I've been attending college here at the University of Minnesota. I graduated. I'm about to submit my final college exam ever. What now? <laughs> now I can do whatever I want. I'm leaving, moving out of Minnesota, and I have not packed one single thing. I don't know where I'm going to move, right? I, this is like a layover period where I figure out what I'm going to do, where I'm going to go. I haven't really had a proper gym. I had two weeks where I was just like hitting exclusively apartment gym workouts. I've been fucking dying to go to a real gym and I haven't taken pre-workout pretty much that entire time. So holy shit, we have to celebrate with some euphoria. Got my water and creatine here. It's nine o'clock, we're going to hit a night lift. So just not even a full scoop. Mm. It's about a 25 minute drive to the gym, let's go. Extremely loud in here, so I don't know if this picks it up. Hopefully it does, but I'm gonna do some commentary today. I got this thing. I'm gonna walk you guys through my chest day. So yeah, a little warm up. It's essentially just shoulders. Cause shoulders is the weakest point on bench press and you don't wanna fuck them up. You wanna get some blood in there, right? So I just grab some like lightweight, like 15, do some like easy laterals, just get blood flowing. I don't care about the monetization of each video, so I can do this with copyright music in the background, which is amazing. Few people can do that, so thank you guys for supporting me through programs and Gymshark. Speaking of Gymshark, if you want anything from Gymshark, anything I'm wearing today, code MAXHOLE gets you 10% off of literally everything. So next on the warm up here, what I'm gonna do is a little bit of lat action. So anything that you can feel your lats in, for me, it's these pull downs, these cable pullovers. They feel amazing in the lats, so I'm just gonna do like a couple really easy sets just to get blood in here but not enough to get like lactic acid and actually start feeling fatigued from it. I'm keeping tension all the way through, all in the lats. First exercise, free barbell bench. I haven't done this in forever, so we're gonna take it easy, warm up a lot, and kind of feel it out. I'm not gonna go past 225 because I don't have a spotter. And quite frankly, I'm weak as fuck. 187 pound, 6'1 lanky ass dude. Do you think you can bench press much? Fuck no. So, this is actually a, is this the power bar? I don't know, it doesn't have knurling in the center and all the power bars have knurling in the center, so I'm gonna switch it out. That's more like it, baby. God, this feels so weird. It's been like three weeks. The bench is kind of slippery, you might throw a pad down. Create an adhesive barrier between you and the bench, essentially. Just like that, no big deal. Matching clips. Lightweight, baby. Wow, that feels good. We're back. What I like to do is walk back and forth, essentially just lubricating the joints, moving the arms around like this. But what I want to point out is look how many combo racks are in this one little confined area. It's like combo rack heaven. This is where it shows us it's going to be a good or bad day. Right here, 185. Bad day. Well, that's what you expect, you know? I'm just coming back. These plates are heavy. This is 46.2. Good song on. Time to fucking go. feels like shit coming back to this, and I don't want to push it with nobody here to spot me. Literally nobody else is here, so we're gonna call it. All right, go to.
Dropping into 185 right away. You know, I'm a volume guy, so all depends on what you're training for. But if you're like powerlifting, trying to gain strength, then I'm not a big fan of drop sets. All right, I'm swinging like a motherfucker, so this mic and shirt have to come off soon, but this is more, you know, within my realm. Not powerlifting stuff, but this is a wide chest press, so it kind of like goes out to the side, so it's almost like a fly. And whenever you use chest machines that kind of fly in, and you're able to like kind of tuck those elbows together and squeeze the elbows, that's like an amazing machine. So although this isn't incline, I prefer incline for just like overall chest development, I'm still gonna do it. So yeah, this just like allows me to load heavy ass weight and not worry about not getting a spot, you know. So this mic comes off, sorry, montage.
it's the next morning, your boy was editing the exact same video that you guys are watching right now. But I got a notification from Amazon that my package was delivered. I think it's over here. She, there it is. All right, let's see what's in this Johnny John. In it, this little SD card, micro SD card actually, because I didn't have one of these, I have normal SD cards. And that drone that I opened in the last video, I haven't been able to use it at all because I didn't have this. So, I have this backpack here with the drone in it that I should be able to fly now. Look at this, in this Gymshark Code Maxwell bag, I'm housing my DJI Mini 3 Pro. You put it right up the ass of the drone and then you can record whatever you want and spy on anyone I want to. Do I know how to fly this? Or do I have any prior aviation experience whatsoever? Hell no, <laughs> but we're still going to. I don't know where to go. I'm assuming somewhere flat, somewhere open to the sky. I think down here. The frog, bro. The grass here is super long, so. Well, I don't even know how to turn this on, so I don't know if this is gonna go too well. All right, I got it. I got it, it's on. Perform a safety check before you fly. All right, we're good. <laughs> I'll start sweating right away, so. All right, let's do it. Dude, this is crazy. Summer sets off fireworks in the mountains of southern Montana. Spurred by heat and hunger, wild horses converge on the cool green heights, and sparks begin to fly. Damn, fuck these bugs, bro. Damn. All right, first time flying this, John. Check this out. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll grab it. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. It doesn't let me do that. Well, we took a little bit of grass off, a little less to mow, but <laughs> we got her back safely, baby. First flight went really good. It was just low battery, so I had to return it, but 